Hello, good morning children. Hope all of you all are fine. And I trust that you have read through the lesson. When I looked at the viewers, very few viewers. That means very few of you all are watching the video. See, it is a must that you should go through the videos because you cannot sit alone and do anything by yourself. So please take page number 21. The last three passages. Let's read through. Deepak, Javed and Adil got up to leave. All of them felt a beautiful bond with each other. So now they went to Sajid's house. Sajid's mother came out with, uh, with a pleasing welcoming. And they were treated very nicely. And Sajid's mother gave them all halwa and they were very happy. Now they are going to leave the house. They are coming away from there, from uh, Sajid's house to their own house. And they felt a beautiful bond, that closeness, togetherness, a good wrap between their family and these children. So they were leaving the house. They were coming away from Sajid's house to their own house. The boys went home. They told their mother, mothers, mothers, here yeah, they used their mothers because all those children's mother. That is why it is used mothers. One child have only one mother. But now here there are so many children over here. So all their mothers. How they had helped Sajid and what a loving mother Sajid had just like their own. So they felt Sajid's mother like their own mother and she was so good to them. Even though the Sajid had uh, hurt himself, the mother did not scold them. She was so loving and she cared them so much and treated them very well. And they were narrating, they were explaining to their mothers about Sajid's mother saying just like their, their own mother, she also treated them. Even the halwa tasted the same. So the halwa what she served them, even that same thing, same, uh, I mean the halwa was tasting the same like their mothers make. Really the other side of the fence is as beautiful as ours. Now they also felt that the other side of the fence was as beautiful as theirs. What they felt, the beauty over here, they felt the same thing the other side when they visited Sajid's house. There is no difference. Then why do we have this ugly barbed wires? So now the children are saying, why this barbed wires are separating the two boundaries? The other side also as good as they are, as good as they are, their side. Asked Adil, Javed, Deepak, Sankita and Sinat in all in one voice. See now they were asking. All in one voice means in unique voice. They were asking. Why this barbed wire separating the, separating the boundary. Turn to page number 22. We want to break it. The sound echoed all around. So now the children they felt that bond between that family and their family. And they said. We want to break it. We don't want to have any, any separation between the boundaries. Ten days later, that means after ten days, there was an envelope lying at the entrance of entrance to Debak's house. Entrance means at the front of the house or at the way you get in inside. So they found an envelope. Envelope means a cover. What was the cover like? In, in that, in it, there was a beautiful drawing of flowers made by Sajid, a kind of thank you note to his friends. There was a letter for Deepak's father as well. So in the envelope, there was a drawing. What was the drawing with beautiful drawing with flowers which Sajid drew? And there was also a letter for the, letter for whom? For Deepak's father. Dear brother, yes, address Debak's father, 
Sajid's father has addressed Deepak's father as dear brother. That shows the bond, that shows the closeness. I want to meet you. Now, what is the introduction given there? I want to meet you. Unfortunately, I cannot because of this ugly border between our village. You should be really proud of your children. I am extremely grateful to them for helping my son. A barbed border is not stronger than the bond of friendship. I am waiting for the day when it will be removed forever. I pray to God for the well-being of your family, your loving neighbor. Now see the uh, letter, what a lovely letter. He wrote a letter saying that, see because of this barbed wire, we are being separated and we are not having the chance of coming that side or this side. So what is the last thing they said? Yes, they are praying for that boundary to be removed, that barbed wire to be removed and to have a very close relation. Now, what did Debak's father do now? Now, and Debak's father replied. See, when you get a letter from somebody, naturally we reply for that. Now, what did Debak's father reply? Let's see. Dear brother, you also addressed, dear brother, our children have only done their duty as fellow human being. Yes. See, now Debak's father has written a letter back to him saying that our children are done their duty as a human being. Every human being has got a, yes, duty like to help your fellow fellow brother, fellow man. Okay. Your, it can be your enemy, can be your friend, it can be a stranger. But you find if they are in trouble, it is our duty to help as a human being. Consideration for a, another human being. I fully agree with you that heart can't be divided by barbed wires. Yes, our love, our care cannot be separated by any barriers. We are praying for your good health and happiness. Affectionately, your brother. So he also wrote a letter very lovingly saying that every human being has a right to help an other human being. So this lesson what does it tell you? What does it teach you? Yes, it can be your enemy or it can be your friend. But in time of need, you should help help others. That is what the lesson says. Please read through the affectionately. What is the word affectionately? That means with so much of affection, so much of love. Okay, so read through this lesson. And let's also go through the exercises. Take page number 23. Tick the correct answer. Tick the correct answer. Why was Sinath almost in tears? There are three options. She was tired. She could not find a pet dog. She could not find her friends. What was the reason? Yes, she could not find a pet dog. The second cow, second box. Please put a tick mark. Who saw Moti going to the other side? Adil, Javed, Deepak. Who saw him? Yes, Adil. The children were overjoyed because they met their parents, found Javed accompanying them, found Moti running towards them. Is yes, the last one. Yes. Now this one you have to write it into your notebook. Each sentence has a mistake. Correct and write, rewrite. The, rewrite. What is the meaning of re? Re means again. Rewrite. Redo. Relay. Again, relay means running that side and this side. Rewrite means write again. Remove means to keep away. Okay. So here you have to rewrite means write again. Dash, not dash. Adil's Ami came out with a big bowl of halwa. Whose mother came out with a big bowl of halwa? Yes. Sajid's mother came out with a big bowl of halwa. So you have to rewrite this. First you have to write this sentence in your book and then rewrite the sentence correctly. Right? Sajid's mother came out with a bowl of halwa. Second one. Adil push Deepak down. Adil push Sajid down. 
Javed Adil and Deepak were playing a game of chess. They were playing a game of horse riding. Sinat saw a small hut. Sinat saw a tin shed. Okay. Now you come to page number. Yes, in the same page there is word quiz. Take that word quiz on the same page. Even Adil was now more friendly with them. Identify the adverb in this sentence. Adverb, which is the adverb? Is it Adil more friendly with? Which is the adverb? Friendly. So tick that C. So I shall come back with the next video.